Listen, and you will hear stories of beauty, strength, and inspiration. Let's talk women talk. Yap Tianning is Singapore's parasailer who claimed her gold medal at the 2014 Asian Para Games. At the tender age of 17, Tianning had a leukemia relapse. Because of her post-treatment that caused a spinal cord inflammation, Tianning was faced with a decision that would change her life forever. Save her life or save her legs. How does one face adversity at such a young age and still continue to charge ahead? You never really liked sailing, yep. right? How did, uh, from not liking sailing to becoming so passionate about the sport, how did that come about? I love the greening trail. I like the freedom, definitely. I want to do the ultimate best and not just do for fun. So that's where I started to um, have my dreams, where I want to push myself to the higher stage. Does sailing make you feel strong? I think definitely, yes. If not for sailing, I think I'll just lost myself. What is it that you've uh, kind of learned from sailing? I learned that no pain, no gain. What I want for sailing, I have to really put in 100% or even more. And there's a lot of sacrifices that nobody see. Sometimes being pushed to the limit that you really cry, but I think at the end of the day, the return is definitely sweetest. I can still remember that day. I was being called to the room with my doctor. They just gave me this question. So would you want to get your bone marrow, your spinal cord inflammation to be treated right now? How was that period like for you? It's like a hell. It's definitely a hell period because it's not just my own emotional to deal with. I have to be in the confined room for, I think, about one to two months. I can't believe it that I actually went through that period of time, actually. Maybe. Do you think you had to kind of grow up very fast because of that? If I don't walk through that pace, and I won't be able to be mature, this really helped in my growing up. And what is your motivation? Um, my mom is someone who has been with me throughout my journey since I'm young till now because a lot of emotional things that I've gone through with her. I'm actually showing it up through action, through sailing. So for people who are afraid to step out of their comfort zone, what advice do you have for them? Be daring, don't be afraid because for this life, we only live this once. You know, don't leave any regrets for yourself, definitely. What do you want to tell Singaporeans about para-athletes? We are no different. We go through the same tough path as well. We are just one Singapore, one big family. <laughs> <laughs> so my final question to you um, is, what is empowerment to you? To have the courage, to be strong, to act as the way you are, despite all the setbacks that you have. I think human beings are like strong walls. We might be shaken at times, but we never collapse. That's fantastic, thank you. Yeah. Thank you for all the words of encouragement, of advice, uh, no, of um, being so inspiring. I wish you all yeah. the very best for the ASEAN Para Games thank and you. for all the other competitions that you're going to do for the rest of your life. Despite her young age, Tianning is wise beyond her years and she believes that ultimately, there will always be